I'm particularly interested, and my research group has focused on the structure and function of membrane proteins. Um, we utilize solid state NMR spectroscopy as a way to look at these proteins in a native-like lipid bilayer environment. It turns out that that's actually critical. The structure of these proteins is dependent upon their environment. And so we look at uh, proteins from influenza uh, and from mycobacterium tuberculosis. And we focus on looking at uh, drug targets, uh, hopefully characterizing them and understanding how they function so that maybe a better drug can be developed. The impact is really going to be dependent upon how, the, how we can progress with this information. If we can collect more of these structures learn more about how these membrane proteins actually function, then that's going to be tremendously useful to the pharmaceutical industry um, and for my own collaborators that take advantage of these structures to determine uh, what molecules will bind and inhibit the function of these proteins. Because it's those inhibitors that then become good uh, leads for pharmaceutical development. And that's absolutely what's needed these days. Um, if you've seen any of the newsreels about how extreme drug-resistant tuberculosis or even multiple drug-resistant tuberculosis, the, so many people are dying because of the side effects of these very toxic drugs that they're having to take at this time. So we need more pharmaceuticals, better pharmaceuticals. And that is the long-term goal for the research. So one of the proteins for influenza that we've been looking at is called the M2 proton channel. This is a channel that's in the viral coat that allows protons to flow into the interior of the virus particle. And if you block it, you prevent infection um, or you stall infection. And um, so that's really a, a, an exciting protein to be working on. We have discovered the mechanism by which protons are transported through this channel. And now we're in the process of actually looking at new pharmaceuticals um, to um, uh, prevent the flow of those protons.